break and stuff. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. I, 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 I hadn't had that much trouble. I mean, I had a few slip on me, but, you know, the majority of them didn't. So, obviously, I'm not blaming it on that by any means. But, um, you know, I my misses haven't been that big in a long time. And, and that's something... Um, you know, there's a couple of reasons mechanically, but I'm not going to get into that. But that's just stuff to address in the bullpen and after I do my video work. And, um, you know, there's no reason to think this is going to be an ongoing thing from start to start, you know. This is this is stuff like this is stuff I feel like myself and Hooky and and um, and all of us are, are really good at addressing and, and kind of nipping in the bud before it becomes a two, three star down type deal. With the way the schedule lines up the next couple of days, do you have an idea when they... Why don't you go back out there? Uh, I'm not sure. I mean, I I think I'm lined up for, like, the off day, so I assume it would be, like, the first day in Houston unless told otherwise. So, um, you, know, I'd, you know, looking forward to that next one. And as you know, I'll be in here doing my work the next few days, and it would be nice to get one in Houston back home. Might sound as it feels good to at least just be talking about results, struggles, instead of physical setbacks. Yeah, I mean, I felt like I kind of got over that yeah. several starts ago. Um, before I even before I even started rehab assignment, you know, I had gotten up to like four or five innings in Arizona before I even started rehab assignment, and then eventually, you know, it was option that had a few more starts or a couple more starts or whatever it was. So, you know, I kind of felt like I had gotten past that stage of just feeling healthy and bouncing back from my starts. I felt like physically I was responding well from start to start over the last you know month or two. So. Um, you know, and physically today I felt fine too. I didn't feel like I was overthrowing or anything. If anything, I felt in that third I might have been guiding it too much, kind of actually letting off the throttle too much, and, and you know, the command kind of suffered because of that. So, you know, sometimes you, you can have your command suffer because you're overthrowing, but there's also the other end of the spectrum where it can suffer if, if you kind of take too much off. That can mess up your timing as well. I mean, does it feel good just to have this out of the way now and kind of be able to move forward in a more normal environment or <clears throat> well yeah i mean it would have felt a lot better if it didn't if we didn't lose you know so i just you know it's tough for me i always i'm always a stickler for just giving us a chance to win and i didn't i didn't do that today and, you know um it's nice to have it out of the way but um you know just get back to work tomorrow and get over this one and, and get back to you know the way i know i can throw and the way i have been throwing you know this is this is very uncharacteristic as to how I've been throwing even over the last couple of months, you know, yeah. so it's it's not necessarily it's not necessarily like a change in competition level. It was a change in uh, decrease of the execution of my stuff um, for that inning, that one inning at right. least. Yeah. First of all, just what was it like to be out there on the mound? It looked like you took a moment. Uh, yeah, man, that was awesome. You know, reception from the fans and um, you know, the excitement of. of teammates and staff and everybody here um, last last day or two um, you know something I'll always remember and always appreciate so um, you know that was the best moment of the day obviously we talked about you you know having to manage your emotions was that harder than what you thought Jimmy getting no out there? I, I felt like I was able to do it pretty well you know um, I got off those first couple innings were pretty smooth so um, you know I was able to control things there just really disappointing frustrating third and you know I haven't I hadn't lost my command like that since like 2016, so um, it's something that's kind of tough to wrap my head around right now, and it really frustrated me. So, um, you know, <laughs> been working for this and thinking about how this day would play out for for almost two years now. So, um, obviously, it didn't play out the way that I had envisioned it, but you know, that's the game, and nothing's necessarily came easy for me in this process or my career necessarily. So. Just another hurdle to get over and uh, work through. So I'll be back here early, early to start that work. Is it hard to find kind of reasons why you feel like you lost that command at this point, or do you need to go back and, and look at stuff? I mean, that's something I'll I'll definitely be able to to see more and piece piece that puzzle together better uh, after seeing the video tomorrow morning. Um, you know, it's just uh, it's it's really it's pretty tough right now. Mm -hmm.